This is a bit of a weird one. British radio presenter Sangeeta Maiske is missing, and now people are asking whether it has something to do with a heated interview that she conducted on her radio show about two weeks ago. The interview is with a, a spokesperson for the Israeli government. I'll show it to you, see what you think, because she hasn't been seen or heard from on the radio since this interview was conducted, and LBC, her employer, have made no statement about where she is. Diplomacy works is uh, consulates and embassies are considered sovereign territory of the government uh, th that is concerned. What Israel did by taking that action against Iran was uh, taken uh, was escalate what is already an incredibly fragile situation. Send, send you to that's an outrageous framing of the reality. It's not what an outrageous happened? framing. I've no, just no, been no, speaking to somebody who is a diplomat to okay. Iran from the UK government. That's not an outrageous sure. framing okay. of it. What Israel did was strike the, what is considered no. in diplomatic circles the sovereign territory of Iran, whether we like it or not. No. And there was undoubtedly going to be a blowback. So did Israel game out what was going to happen next? Uh, firstly, I'm not going to speak directly to that strike. What I can say definitively, and this is why it's outrageous, what I can say definitively is that that wasn't an embassy, it wasn't a consulate, it wasn't any type of diplomatic mission. It's been it was widely reported as that. It's been widely because that's what Iran that. says. Because that's what Iran says. So do you, would you like to copy and paste? Um, Are a, you suggesting a, a every regime? single news organization in the world has got that wrong? No, I'm suggesting that the Iranians have an interest to say that that was a diplomatic mission when we know definitively it wasn't, okay? Because they then want to give you the response that you've just copied and pasted with all due respect. So I can tell you that I can't speak directly to the strike, but I can say that definitively that was an Al-Quds military um, uh, base being used by, a, uh, by, by forces of, of the Iranian regime. And uh, 